Welcome to our first annual Healthcare Agency Medical Education Conference. Oh, I got it out. I've been practicing. Yeah. Uh, we're delighted that you're here today. Don't worry, I think you saw on the agenda that uh, I had welcoming comments uh, for 30 minutes. Uh, not sure how I'm going to do that. I do have a PowerPoint on welcoming for 30 minutes, but I'm going to spare you that. Uh, but we're delighted that you're here today. Uh, the healthcare agency in BCMC is a, a teaching system. And also, we want to be a community resource. So it's a natural extension of our system that we would want to hold conferences like this really every year. Uh, we think it's wonderful that uh, we've selected, or this program has been selected, the Pediatric Oncology Program here at VCMC, uh, along with our partnership with Children's Hospital LA. Uh, this is a, is a wonderful program, uh, the only one uh, of its kind here in the county, and helps those many families who would otherwise have to go to uh, Los Angeles or somewhere outside of our, of our county. And uh, we're so fortunate to have it here, and there's a few people here today, actually, who uh, really are responsible for making it happen. And one of those is uh, Dr. Stu Siegel, who's the director of uh, children's uh, cancer and blood diseases at Children's Hospital uh, Los Angeles. And Dr. Siegel has been uh, a longtime friend of the system, of the physicians here, our staff, and our patients and families. And so we're just thrilled that he's here uh, with us uh, this morning. Uh, also, Dr. Landon, our director of pediatrics here at VCMC, uh, been talking about this program for since I can't remember, since I've known Dr. Landon, which is probably about 15 years. Uh, so uh, they've done just a tremendous job. The Junior Charities League, uh, I have to tell you, uh, they just embraced this project from the get-go. And uh, without several of these sort of founding folks, uh, I'm not sure the program would be here. And it was with their real passion and enthusiasm that has really brought it here. Uh, but also uh, Dr. Flossie here, our director of our pediatric unit here at BCMC. Our pediatric hospitalist was instrumental in making sure that we were able to bring this program here to VCMC. And then, of course, Dr. Bracho, who's done such a fabulous job uh, actually running the program and uh, providing the great care that all of the, the children are getting there. So thank you to all of you and the great work that you've done. Thank you. And the people also really doing the work, the nursing staff, uh, who's at the pediatric clinic doing a great job for the program as well. So, as I say, we are a, a teaching system here. So we have our residency program, of course, uh, which is so integral to everything we do here at VCMC. Uh, it's just such a big part of it. And it is, actually, most of you know this, but maybe some of you don't, the oldest and largest family medicine program in the state of California. Yeah. It just had its 80th anniversary last year. Yeah. Uh, we weren't sure what you get for an 80th anniversary. Is, it, is that wood or gold or what, what do you get? But it was a pretty special uh, occasion. And uh, I think, what's that? That's what you get is a cutting fund. Cutting fund, yeah, that's right. Congratulations. Yes, wonderful. Thank you very much. So nevertheless, the, the residency program is standing strong at 42 residents. Uh, and it's just, as I say, such a big part of our system, and, and part of that is the teaching aspect, because we have outstanding residents from across the country. But that also means we have outstanding faculty here, both family physicians and specialists who are so passionate about teaching our residents. And it just really infuses, I think, our whole system here. And we are delighted also now to welcome back, uh, and I say back to our system, our new uh, residency director, uh, who actually graduated from our program some years ago went off, I won't say went astray, but went off to become uh, the residency director uh, at uh, Mercy Hospital in Merced for 10 years, but has now come home, come back home to our residency program, and we're just delighted that he's here with us, uh, and that's Dr. David Arajo. Thank you, David. I will turn it over to you. Thank you. Thank you, Mike. And uh, welcome to as Mike said, our first uh, medical education forum, healthcare, healthcare agency medical forum. I was asked to be the host and introduce our speakers, but I want to take just a few minutes to also welcome all of you. For those of you who don't um, normally come here for talks, that kind of thing, just to let you know, brief housekeeping things, there's bathrooms that direction through the cafeteria and right by the uh, elevators on the first floor. And then secondly, um, we do, as Mike mentioned, uh, want to know what kind of topics you would like in the future. There, our idea with this as medical education at VCMC is to uh, make this an annual event where we have a healthcare agency sponsored educational forum. And so if there's ideas uh, of topics 
Um, our idea is to have this focus for primary care physicians, um, but if there's special ideas that you would like, please, please let us know. Um, and in addition, I really do need to thank the support of the healthcare agency leadership. So Mike Powers as the uh, director of the healthcare agency, and Bob Gonzalez, the medical director, and then also Paul Lorenz, the hospital administrator, have put their support behind this and really come forward to help support this concept of putting medical education and VCMC uh, on the map. Now, as uh, Mike mentioned briefly, the residency program has a long history here, and um, it's started, the, the family medicine residency program started in 1969, although there's been a history of medical education before that. But 1969 is when family medicine started as a, as a specialty, and this residency program is one of, I think it's 12 original programs that started in the country. Um, it has a long, long distinguished history. There's now about 435 um, uh, family medicine residency programs in the country, and so we remain one of those original uh, programs that started in 1969. Over the years, it's grown, and as uh, Mike mentioned, I was a resident here in the mid-'80s, and at that time, I actually met Dr. Siegel, who's going to be our first speaker. And he has a long history with VCMC of coming up from Children's Hospital in L.A., and I remember him um, with Charlie Fletcher, who was another instrumental member of the, uh, of the medical education team who's given a lot to the program. And for many residents over the years who trained with Dr. Fletcher, it was a, it was a very good and great experience. So the first talk uh, this morning Dr. Siegel is going to give is entitled, you know, 50 Years of the Fight Against Cancer, Pediatric Cancer, but it's really a retrospective and a review of, uh, of cancer care uh, over the last 50 years. So with that, we'll welcome Dr. Siegel. <laughs> 